Hello, it's Philip Taylor speaking from Richmond Green Chambers. This evening I'm looking at an interesting book from Butterworths. It's the Commercial and Consumer Law Handbook, now in a 7th edition. It's this work here. Quite a heavy book. There's the spine and there's the uh, back uh, cover. It's been written by consultant editors Richard B. Morey uh, QC, and Tobias Riley Smith. It's interesting to have a useful little bit of shading there for the various areas to look at. The paper's a bit thin, so do take a bit of care. That's the front of it, and then you go into the main work itself. Substantial and detailed contents, and then you've got the actual Acts of Parliament themselves and the notes, which are, of course, invaluable for practitioners, because that's what we're looking at. Part one is on the statutes. Part 2 then goes into statutory instruments. Part 3 is on other materials. That's directives and all sorts of other things of, of quite substantial interest. And then 4, uh, the, the last bit, are the appendices. The work is quite substantial in terms of the size of it. There's a very detailed index which is at the back. And what you've got is you're running to... Uh, quite substantial number of pages, as I indicate, because the index it goes on for quite a long, um, long period. There are, of course, um, appendices as well, which start uh, just there, so you can see see them. Now, the book is now in the seventh edition. We've written a review of it, which is on the web. Um, Certainly Butterworth's LexisNexis have come up with an excellent handbook again, and one which will be very, very important for people in commercial and consumer law. What we say is it's incorporating reference materials in commercial and consumer law which are applicable in England and Wales, the EU and internationally. So whether you're a barrister, solicitor, company secretary or in any way professionally involved, in the area of commercial and consume and or consumer law, you'll need this, the seventh and latest edition, of what is an authoritative, dependable, indeed indispensable work of reference, especially as the new edition contains a significant amount of new material, as well as the all relevant legislation in the field dating from 1677 Statute of Frauds to 2012. It's, um, we've written a very detailed review, so I won't go into a lot of um, commentary on it now, because we explain really what's new about the book, and what we think um, is of relevance to a lot of people. As we're all consumers of goods and services, the field of cons commercial and consumer law is a wide and broad um, area for human endeavour itself. Therefore, there's a comprehensive source of statutory material um, pertinent to this area of law. So within the 2,000 pages, it's inevitably going to be a wide-ranging work of reference which encapsulates all the relevant statutory materials in one handy paperback format. I'd like to thank uh, the two editors, Richard B. Morey, QC, and Tobias Riley Smith, and to um, LexisNexis Butterworths for producing what is a very important work in this area of law. Thank you to all concerned. Bye-bye.